Start recording. Okay. All right. Hi, Lara. Okay. Can catch everybody. All right. Can you guys see me? Close enough. Everybody can see me and hear me. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I'm gonna play around with this for next time, but this is the quietest place I can be without having to wake up the whole house. Okay. All right. So, you guys, we're gonna go through one duty with the band, one upper body, and then we'll do a hybrid of both, um, and then we'll do our finisher. Okay. You're gonna need medium weight, um, some heavier weights, and some weights. So three sets of weights probably for today. And a band. Um, if I'm echoing, make sure you guys have me on mute. I think that's probably in the garage, or have yourself on mute. Yeah, I hear myself. I hear myself. Okay. okay, it's fine. As long as you guys can hear me. Everybody good? Okay. All right, we're going to start with 30 seconds of jumping jacks, 30 seconds of lateral shuffle. You guys all have done this one before. going to make sure I have the timer up here so you guys can hear it and I can hear it. All right, so we're going to get this set up. We're going to do 30 seconds of jogging in place. 30 seconds of lateral shuffle. We're going to do this two times, um, and then we'll start the rest of the warm-up, okay? So we'll start at the clock as it comes down. Starting in five. You guys can hear that. Four, three, two, one. All right, one. that 30 Begin. seconds, jogging in place. Just get it nice and loose. Good, it's about 100% humidity here. so. If the camera starts flashing up, let me know, you guys. All right, we're just bobbing back and forth, getting nice and loose. You can think about picking up those heels, kicking your butt a little bit more. In three, two, one, Next. two steps to the side, squat down. Two steps forward, squat down. This is really important to warm up those glutes and those quads for our Salute workout. We have booty bands on our first circuit. So it's important to make sure we're nice and loose here. All right. Sitting evenly on both legs so that squat down. Two hands touch. All right. We're jogging. Back and forth. Back and forth is that jog. Think about kicking up those knees a little bit and then kick your, pick up your heels. So rotate between the two. Up high knee, left kick. Kind of just going back and forth. Good, guys. All right, we'll do our last set of lateral shuffles in three, two, one. Next. Two over, squat, two back, squat. Good. If you're finding yourself not sitting on both feet evenly, make sure both hands are touching each time. 15. Almost there. All right. After this, we're going to go into some good mornings. In three, two, one. Next. Good, guys. All right. Hands over your heart. You got eight good mornings coming down, right back up. Okay. Feel that nice hamstring stretch. Woo. My heart's beating so fast already. <laughs> we just did a warm up. 15. Five, six, seven, and eight. Good, guys. We got five chicken sleeps per side. You can stay where you are. Don't have to walk. Turn this off. All right. So we're going to alternate hands, alternate legs here. Reach down, push those chickens away. Warm up. Get some nice stretch on those hamstrings. You're going to do four, uh, five per side. Good. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good guys, we got reverse lunge with a twist. You're gonna do five per side here. We're only doing this work warm up once. So reverse lunge, turn towards that front knee and back up. Okay. We're gonna do five per side here. Two, three, four. Five, we got five more. 
get that nice rotation on your obliques as you turn, warm up that lower back. Good, last one here. Good guys, all right. We're gonna walk it out to an inch and we're gonna stay in that high plank. Okay, so take your hands, touch your toes as low as you can and walk it out. It's gonna be in a high plank here, okay? And we're gonna do five per side um, shoulder taps. Touch one hand with one, hand with one shoulder, one shoulder with one hand, five times, alternating, stay nice and still, okay? Do that, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. After that, you guys, we're gonna stay down here nice and low and do a cat-cow stretch, okay? So we're gonna come up for a big cow, cat stretch, invert for cow. We're doing this one more time, big stretch, and then invert for cow. Good. Stay right here. We got bird dog, five per side. Everybody ready? There we go. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Come in for a crunch. We got five per side. Flex that foot. Three, four, and five. Split sides here. Left arm, right leg. Come in for a crunch. Two, three, four, and five. Good, you guys, back on those heels. We're gonna walk it back up standing. We're gonna do a couple arm circles. You guys can see me. There we go. We're gonna do five arm hugs. So five per side, big, I'm oh, sorry, this is arm circles, arm hugs. Five arm hugs, two, three, four, five, five arm circles. Okay, forward. Rotate those shoulders and then backwards for five. And then we're getting started with circuit number one. Three, four, five. All right, you guys. Grab those bands. Everyone feeling nice and warmed up? I think the hardest part about being here is I have nobody to talk with while I'm working out. I'm just talking to myself and you guys in the camera. Not as fun as in person. Okay, here we go. We got... Band work first. We're doing 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. Actually, we're gonna do 50, just kidding, 50 and 10, okay? We don't need that much rest for these. All right, so we are gonna start with a lateral, one quarter, a lateral squat um, uh, side step, okay? So lateral squat, one quarter, we're gonna go twice then stand. Now, ideally, I want you to be pulling this band apart as you are stepping over, okay? So we're really activating your sides of your glutes, your gluteus medial, as you step over, okay? So one quarter squat or even lower. And we're working on moving sideways, at least two steps. You can release after two if you want. If you have more room, you can do three in a row, but we're doing that for 50 seconds, okay? That's exercise one. Exercise two is a nice big sumo squat here to a curtsy lunge, okay? Sumo squat, curtsy lunge. So doing sideways and curtsy, okay? 50 seconds of that, rotating, switching sides on each, switching sides for each curtsy lunge, okay? Then we got reverse, our three-point abduction. We're gonna stand still, if you see me, and we're gonna tap over, tap to the back, or tap to the side, tap to the back. So laterally, 45 degrees, and then straight behind, okay? We'll switch at the halfway mark each time for that one, for legs. And then our last one is gonna be a donkey kick. You guys know this one, hands and knees, okay? Pulling in those, that core nice and tight as we flex our foot. We're gonna kick straight back. Or if you want more hamstrings, you're gonna kick more up, okay? We'll do those, we'll alternate legs for that one too. Okay, those four exercises, lots of glutes. Questions, very good. All right, four exercises. We're going to go through this um, twice since I'm doing it 50 seconds each this time. All right, we will start at the beep. Make sure everybody can see. There we go. Oh, here we go. All right. Starting in five. Starting four, in five seconds. Three, two, one. Begin. All right, we're moving sideways. Two steps to the side. And then you can come back up two steps to the side come back up okay 
nice and low here. The idea is that you have to really pull these band apart. So I want you to think about taking nice wide steps with the band, okay? It's kind of like, instead of doing a monster walk, I want to do something sideways today. That's why we're doing it this way. Getting low and then coming back up. We're halfway done. Next round, if you're feeling good, grab a weight. You can always grab a weight for this. Just give your quads and your glutes a little bit more to focus on a little more resistance. Good, guys. We're almost there. We got five seconds to go. Woo! Rest. Ooh, good work. All right. We got two most squats. Big, wide squat with a curtsy lunge. So we're here. Okay? Squat, curtsy lunge. Squat, curtsy lunge. You got it. Stay up nice and tall here. Good. Staying here, we're pulling this band apart as far as you can. Try not to slam your foot, your knee on the concrete. This is when I need my nice big mat. Good guys, nice and wide here. I'm sitting my arms out like that just to remind you, spread out. Take a lot of the space, pull that band. Woo. We got 10 seconds. Almost there. Five seconds. Three. Get this last one in. Rest. Ooh, shake it out. Okay. We got three point abduction. So, three point tap. Start with that right leg. Move. Laterally one, diagonally, and back. That's it. While you're doing that, focus on the floor, getting nice and tight. Good. We will swap sides at the halfway mark. You guys remember roly poly bugs? There's one joining my workout underneath my foot as I speak right now. 25. Very exciting. Switch sides, guys. Left, laterally, and back. Good. Stay, try to stay nice and still. Only thing moving is this leg that's tapping out. Okay? You should be feeling that the side of your glute. Even on the planted one. Five seconds. Three, two, Rest. and time. All right, we got donkey kicks. You're on your mat. Let's start with that left leg first. There we go. Left leg. Let's go. We're working. So straight back behind you. We are kicking. We didn't do these last week. We've been doing the straight leg. So I thought it'd be good to add these back here because it's always a good glute move. But make sure you're controlling. We're not swinging. We're controlling the kick out behind you. We're swapping right now. Switch leg. We're on that right leg now. Kicking straight out behind you. Are up. So some of you guys might want to do that more up, more hamstring and less glute. But play around with it and see what works for you. All right, we are completely done. Round one. Rest. Good, guys. All right, pop back up. We've got round two coming up. Grab a weight if you're feeling good. We are low. Ooh. We are low here. We are stepping over two steps. Back up, release. Two wide steps. Good. Take your time. Not speeding through this. Good. Grab that weight if you want one for this round. One, two. If you're feeling good, you don't have to release it. Stay low. Okay. One, two, and back. 25. Woo! Halfway there. Sit back and down. You guys got it. Yeah, 10 seconds to go right here. Good, guys. Five seconds. As you get tired, make sure we're stretching out that band. Rest. Woo. Good work. All right. Two most squat, first two lunge. With a weight, without a weight, either way, we're still working hard. Nice and wide here. Squat, curtsy. Squat, curtsy. 
You got it. Put back and down. Sit low. Ideally, you want that squat to be parallel to the ground, working with your own range of motion. You guys are all looking really good. Nice deep curtsy lunge. Halfway there. Okay, guys, 20 seconds to go. Right, already less than 20. Sit back and down. That band should be tight enough that you feel the resistance on your legs as, as you let sumo. Three seconds. Two, one. Rest. Woo. All right, if you want a, arm, a shoulder workout for this one, you're gonna hold a weight, a light weight in front of you, okay? Ooh. Hold it like that, as we're doing that three point tap. And we're working right now. Tap, tap, tap behind you. Tap, tap, tap. You don't have to do this with your shoulders. You can if you want, we got plenty of shoulders coming up soon. Woo. Five seconds. We're swapping sides. Three, two, 25. and swap. Left, left leg coming out. Stay nice and square. Good, pulling that band apart. Make sure that band's in a spot that you're getting the resistance. If it's too high, it's too easy. So make sure that you're working your hardest. Three, two, one. Rest. All right, guys. Last set of donkey kicks right here. I got some Enrique Iglesias playing. All right, here we go, guys. Donkey kicks. Oh. I just found this mix, like top 2000, but I think you guys will like it. I don't know if you can hear it. Woo. I need to find a way to share it through my computer so it goes like directly into your uh, speaker, so then you won't be able to hear me, which might be a good thing. All right, we're swapping legs in three, two, Five. one. This leg straight back behind you. Woo. Good guys, focus on that core, pulling up that belly button, your abdominal floor, pelvic floor as you are kicking back behind you. It's a really good way to focus on your deep abdominal breathing here as we're not doing something super strenuous. All right, guys, take off those bands. We're doing two rounds since we did such a long 50 seconds. We'll come back to more glute work. Uh, after this next upper body workout. All right, guys, here we go. You got foot lunge with the shoulder raise. Grab your water. Got some Brittany here. All right, lateral uh, foot lunge, shoulder raise. Okay, 45 degrees, not arm, not arm straight out here. Okay, we're gonna have about 45 degrees. You're gonna be split lunge stance, so this way. Okay. And we're just going to let raise as we come down. Raise and come down. We're not swinging the weight. Nice and controlled. Okay. We're going to do 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. We're going to go through this three times. Okay. This is our upper body. Um, so I want to make sure, actually, we're going to do 50 to 10. Sorry, I'm all over the place. 50 to 10. And we're going to swap halfway through with our legs. Okay. So those are our shoulder raises with the split lunge. Then we have straight arm kickbacks to a chest fly. You guys, we did the straight arms last week. We're gonna be hinged over here, straight arm. Then you're gonna come here for a chest fly. So straight arm kickback, touch your weights together, chest fly, okay? So think about making more of a parallel line with your body to the ground, with your arms, okay? Straight arms for that kickback, no swinging, nice and controlled. Then we have a bicep curl to an overhead press. We've been doing a lot of those guys, but they're so good. This time we're gonna hold that weight above our head. We're gonna curl all the way down. So we're gonna start here, come all, curl all the way down, up, trade off at the top. Okay, curl, full curl, trade off at the top. Okay, so you got an overhead hold. Those are the biceps. And then the last one is a T press. You guys know this one. We will do an uneven push up, turn and rotate straight up on that one arm, okay? turn and rotate. We're going to stay on that same arm until the halfway point. So all the ones that we're swapping are going to be at that halfway point. Okay. Everyone got it. 
I know I went over it fast, but um, if you have questions, just holler at me, flag me down. Okay, I think you guys know all of these moves. There's nothing new in here. We're gonna do 50 seconds on 10 seconds of rest. We're gonna go through this twice, at least twice, maybe three times. I'm gonna kind of wait and see how it goes. All right, everyone good? Let me move you guys over here. All right, we are starting in five seconds with a split lunge, with a shoulder raise. Starting in five, four, three, two, right. one, begin. All right, split lunge, you guys. Split lunge. We are raising. Okay. Good. This is a little harder to go super heavy on this exercise. You guys know that by now. You can get heavy, but be careful that you're not just swinging the weights then. Okay. Ideally, we're controlling all of this up and down. Just the parallel. See yourself in the 25. Switch legs. Watch yourself in the camera. That way you can fix your form to make sure you're not going too far above your arm, above your shoulders for that raise. Good. Your lunges are nice and deep. The, the camera is a perfect opportunity, like a mirror to see what you're doing. Woo, we're almost there. Rest. All right, okay. All right, we get straight arm kick back with a chest slide. Same, same thing again. Hard to go super heavy on these. Find a moderate weight. All right, we are straight arm kick back, chest fly. Straight arm kick back, chest fly. Then straight arm kick back, you should feel in the whole part of your back of your arm. Good. Got it, guys. Halfway done. It's a long time for this exercise because we're not swapping sides. Focus on your breath. Keep those shoulders up. Put your booty out behind you. You should be in a nice, uh, a nice, not curved, but a little bit of a closed hip angle here. Good, guys. Almost there. Five seconds. Rest. Good. All right. Curl overhead press with the hold. Five step curl. Here we go. One arm's up, one arm curl, swapped up with, swapped out with the other one. Curl and press. Nice and controlled, you guys, the whole time. Not for speed, this isn't hit. It doesn't matter how many reps you get, as long as they're perfect, I don't care. Good. Good, guys, halfway done right here. I think these longer uh, sets make it a little more challenging. 30 seconds are already passed. That's usually what we go to. 50 seconds is a long time. We're going to have some muscular endurance, some hyper hypertrophy training. That means it's going to be a good day to wear your thong, Suzanne. All right, here we go. All right, guys. We got a T press, one weight, push up, and a rotation. Okay? Move. Push up, one rotation. Nice and straight here. We'll swap arms at the halfway point. Rotate. Okay? Push up and rotate. The timing, guys, is 10 seconds in between. So be ready for the next exercise. I'll try to prep you a little better. Got it. Push up, turn, rotate. 25. Side, same thing. Uneven push up. Turn, rotate on that hand, straight arm up. You're If you are on your knees, you're doing the same thing. The modification is on your knees. You can do all of this from those knees. You're still working just as hard. Focus on that breath. Turn, rotate. Woo. Rest. Good job, guys. Hop up. We have 10 seconds before our next round. We got a split lunge. Here we go. Grab those weights. Split lunge, shoulder raise. Good. You got it. 45 degrees. Woo! The shoulders. Should be feeling it. That back. Working hard. Press to that front foot as you do your shoulder raise. Okay? You don't have to follow my feet. 
If you're feeling good, go faster. Switch. 25. Let's switch legs here. Woo. We're raising. Good, guys. We're almost there. We got 10 seconds. My shoulders are close. Keep going. Five seconds. Three, two, time. Woo! Shake it out if you need to, I do. All right, straight arm kick back, chest fly. Here we go. Straight arm behind you, two hands, open up that chest, okay? Two arms, kick back, two arms open at your chest from the side. We're here. Focus on that breath. Shoulders are back, even though we're hinged over at our hips. Good, guys. 25. You got it. Check your form on the mirror. Good. If you're not feeling enough, you need to make sure you're hinged over at those hips enough. Okay? Woo! We're almost there. Woo! Hang in there. Five seconds. Feel how strong you're getting. Three, two. Rest. All right. 50 seconds, guys, coming up. We got bicep curl, overhead press, the hold. Let's go. Lock that arm up. Curl, overhead press. Let's go. Curl, press. Control all these movements, the down, the up. Pulling that belly button, make sure you're nice and tight here. Good, guys. I am set up right in the garage, which is right on the road. So I have not been a lot of cars, a lot of golf carts driving by, but some people are like, what the hell is that lady doing? Keep the tripod and the camera and all that. It's kind of funny. But at least there's not a lot of traffic this early in the morning. Which is kind of all right. We got eight seconds. Dig deep here. Three seconds. Rest. Uh, Good work, guys. We got our last round of three press. We're going to do two rounds again because the time. We got plenty of time. All right, seat press, guys. Move. We got a push up, turn, and rotate. We're going to switch arms halfway through. Good, guys. You got it. This is a hard one. Stick with it. Find a good pace and do the same pace. Turn. Rotate, stretch up. Good, we're switching sides right here. Five. Turn, rotate, plant that hand in the ground, and push up. Okay, rotate, push up. We're almost there. 10 seconds. You got this. Come on. Nice straight line here. Push up. Okay. Rest. Good, guys. All right, we're doing one more round. We got plenty of time. We only did two of the booty at the beginning. Ooh. Split lunge. Here we go, guys. Last round. Make it the best. 45 degrees. I know you're tired. You can do it. Take short breaks if you need. Good. We'll swap legs. We do a little break here. In. Six seconds. Woo! This is a hard one. After the shoulders. 25. Switch sides, guys. Lauren, you would hate it here. It is literally so humid. Like, it's humid for me. And you know I don't care about humidity. Okay. 10 seconds. Push through. Come on. Make these perfect. This is our last time doing this exercise today. Three. Two, one. Good, guys. We got straight arm kickbacks, chest fly. Let's do it. There we go. Pinch over, booty out behind you. Straight arm, chest fly. For this chest fly, your arms are slightly bent. You can bend those elbows a little bit. Okay? Good. Make sure they're coming out as a chest fly, not a raise. We're not raising, yours is a raise. So make sure they're touching 
we're and coming out laterally, okay? Pull them apart from each other. More of a chest fly, not a raise. I found myself trying to raise, but you really want to pull them apart, not lift them up. Good, guys. Looking good. You got it. Ten seconds. Try not to swing like me. Just stop myself swinging. Focus on that form. Rest. Shake it out, guys. This is killer. You're doing awesome. All right. Bicep curl overhead press. Lock that arm up. Curl. Press. I see you guys. I see you moving slow. Come on. Push hard to this. We'll get a nice rest shortly. You got it. Perfect form. Good. Lock that arm right over your head. Halfway done here. 25. Over the hump. It's only going to get easier as we come down towards the finish line. Woo! We got the shoulder T press next. Okay. Everybody working at their own pace here. Pulling that belly button as you're getting tired. Got it. Three seconds. Rest. Awesome, guys. Shake it out. Last 50 seconds coming up. Then we'll get a nice long break. Keep press. There we go. Ooh. Push up. Turn and rotate. One press. You got it. Turn, rotate, and a press. Settle in here, get a nice pace, stick with it. Push up, turn, rotate, press. We're swapping in three, 25. two, one. Swap out, push up, turn, press. You got it, guys. Woo! We got 10 seconds right here. Two more, get two more in. And then you are done. Nice long rest in between. Upper body should be ready for a break. Awesome, guys. Woo! That was killer. You guys did awesome. Grab some water. I'm going to get the next one ready to go for us. Okay. Can we give our upper body a break? We got two band exercises, okay? Two band exercises. And then we got two upper body exercises. We're gonna do them back to back, okay? So you put your band back on. We got in and out. This should be nice and light, not as, as tedious as some of the other exercises we do, okay? We're gonna be in a quarter squat. Your feet are gonna rotate onto the outside where your pinky toe is. You're gonna rotate a little bit out there, okay? And we're gonna come in and out with our knees. So kind of like a clamshell, but we're standing, okay? We're gonna come in and out with those knees to work the side of your glutes. We're doing that for 30 seconds, 15 seconds of rest, okay? Then we're gonna do Romanian deadlift with our band, which is totally fine. You can take one dumbbell or two, and a Romanian deadlift means we're just gonna put our glutes behind us, more of a straighter leg, with a little bend, we're just gonna come down, right below our knees and come back up, okay? Really, I want you to think about engaging those glutes as you come down and you're gonna pull up using those glutes. We're doing those two glute exercises, then you can leave your band on if you want. We have a wood chop with a push press. So that wood chop is gonna be a step, okay? A diagonal wood chop, we're coming from the right side to the left side, okay? Then up with a push press. So that is you're using your legs to drive that weight above. We already did a strict press today, so we're doing a push press. We'll do 30 seconds on one side, 30 seconds on the other, um, uh, different rounds. And then our last one is, I had you guys doing a, a renegade row. So we'll be in this push up position, okay? And we're just gonna row this way, okay? You'll row for 30 seconds, we'll swap for the next one. All right, we're going to go through this three times. So we'll swap out um, halfway through, or halfway through the last round. 
All right, so 30 seconds should feel like a breeze considering we just did 15. Um, and we're gonna do this three times. All right, everybody good? Yeah, okay. I always think no response is a good response since I can't hear anybody. All right, Starting here in we five, go, guys. Four, three, so two, one. We are rotating begin. outside of your feet here. I don't know if you guys can see my feet here. And we're coming in, out, in, out. That's it, okay? Think about more of an internal, external. It doesn't have to be fast. You know, this is really like a dance move. If you did 15. this, that, you know that? Then think of it like that, using those glutes. We got eight seconds. You know what I'm talking about. Almost like the Tootsie Roll. Yeah, there you go. Rest. Woo! That one does work if you do it right. We got a Romanian deadlift here. Grab one weight, two weights, whatever you're feeling. A kettlebell is fine. So, hopes are going to come back behind you. Ooh. Reach down, come back up. Okay? This should feel nice and easy considering what we've been doing. But I want you to focus on activating the glutes to do the driving. Okay? Up, reach, up, reach. 15. Good. You guys got it. Reach, back up, reach down, back up. We're almost there. So if you're going super heavy, you'll feel this a little more. I'm going pretty light here. Rest. Good. All right, you got a wood chop. Pick a light to moderate. Nothing super heavy for this wood chop. You're going to be rotating sideways. Let's do right arm first. Right arm, left leg. Coming across your body here. Ooh. Let's go. Wood chop. Single arm press, okay? Take your time here. Rotate, press. You see how I snuck some core in there? We know we're doing arms. Okay, guys. Drive. 15. With that arm, rotate sideways. Whew. You got it. Awesome, guys. Keep it up. I like this rotation on that. Those are Rest. Good. We're resting. We got a renegade row. Let's do that left arm first since we just did that right arm. Okay, it's gonna be in a high plane. Nice straight body. No turning out that hip. Move. So hip, that left hip stays down. We're, ro we're rowing. We're not rotating. Nice and controlled here. Woo! Upper body is still feeling it from earlier. That's a good sign. 15. We're almost there, guys. Stick with it. Three, two, and nine. Fast. Woo! All right, we're back to the top. In and out. See how fast that went? 30 seconds of breeze. I am so sweaty. Woo! All right, here we go. Slide down, rotate out a little bit. We're going in and out. We're dancing now. This is what everybody wants. If you're feeling great, you can hold a weight. It's not going to really do much because we're not really moving. We're staying in this squat. 15. But it'll work your upper body a little bit. You don't have to. It's up to you. I am not. I'm just working those glutes. We're almost there, guys. Pulling that belly button as you're working. Oh, boy. All right. We got Romanian deadlifts here. Side will weights you want to use. Pushing that booty out behind you. Slight knee bend. If you're feeling it more in your hamstrings, make sure you're bent enough. Okay, we're not really working those hamstrings too much right now. We want glutes. Reach and stand. Reach and stand. Good. We're not going for speed here. We're going for control. Feel that muscle connection. 15. With your glutes. Good. We're almost done. Five seconds. Ooh. Rest. Good, guys. All right, we're back to upper body. We got a wood chop, left side. I think the wood chop feels feeling really good. The renegade row, not so much. But the wood chop, good. Left arm, right leg. Here we go. Ooh. Rotate, bring it back, press. Okay? As you get the hang of it, 
Make sure we stay nice and braced with our core. Lower back is protected as we rotate. Okay, we're turning. No obliques, not the whole body. Good. You guys are looking good. Almost there. Five seconds. Come on, guys. Rest. Awesome. All right, we've got Renegade Row on the right side now. All right. Here we go. Everybody keep that right hip. That hip bone should be facing the ground, not rotating. If you have to rotate to get that weight up, let's go a little lighter. Focus on that form. Fifteen. All right, we're almost there. Guys, got it. Stay nice and still. Rest. All right. Last round, guys. This will be quick. And then we'll do our burnout. We're done. We'll be done in less than 10 minutes. All right. We got in and out. Last 30 seconds. You should be perfecting these by now. In, out, in, out. If you want to wait, you're holding it in your hands. Woo! Good. You got it. Come on, get low. Rotate. In out, you should be feeling that right there, the side of your glutes. All we're doing is putting those knees in and out, pulling that band apart. Sneakily hard. Three, two, and time right here. Rest. Woo. All right, get the Romania deadlift. All right, push those glutes back behind you. Here we go. Good morning. Reach down, come up. Reach down, come up. Using those glutes. People think I'm crazy, but people are trying to be fine. It's hilarious. Okay. 15. That's okay. We can be crazy and work out. It's him. It's fine. Pull those glutes. You make sure the glutes are pulling your arms up. So everything's connected here. We're driving with our glutes. Thanks, flat feet. Rest. Good. All right. Last set of foot chops. We are alternating sides at the halfway mark. So get ready for that cue. Start with that right side. Here we go. Right arm, left leg Ooh. coming across and press. Last round. You can do it. Move a little faster than you did last round because you're at the home stretch here. We're swapping in three, two, 15. one. Swap out, left arm, left arm press. Wood chop and press. Make sure you get that wood chop in. Rotate with that weight. Feel it in your core. Rest. Awesome, guys. We got Renegade Rail. We are done. 15 seconds on each side. Listen for that cue to click. All right. There we go. Last 30 seconds, you guys. You got this. We're rowing. Keep those hips straight. Look at the camera. Make sure your body is straight. You can do it. Perfect form. Swap out. Nice and straight here. Tap it to the ground. Pull it right back up. Control that movement. You got this. Great way to kick off the week. Three, two, and time. Awesome, guys. Grab some water. We got a quick burnout, and then we're done. Good work, guys. All right. We don't need any bands. You can take off the bands for this last little bit of work. Okay? You've got three minutes of work, and then you are done. You guys know how I love to do the, the burnouts. All right, so we got three exercises, one minute each, and then we are done. So we're gonna start with, you can use a band for this. I prefer not to. I think it's a lot easier, or I think it's more effective without the band, okay? You're gonna do a fire hydrant. We haven't done these today. We haven't done these actually in a couple weeks. So legs and come out, kick it, come back. 
okay? Like a fire hydrant, like a dog peeing on a fire hydrant. So we're gonna do 30 seconds on one side, 30 seconds on the other. That's it. So make it count, perfect form, pulling the app, pulling the core as you're doing it. Then we're gonna do bear stance taps. One minute. No cardio, guys, not bear hop, bear taps. So it means it's bear stance, okay? So knees are hovering above the ground. Tap, tap, that's it. Slow and controlled shoulder taps. It's killer on your thighs. It'll be killer because you have to keep, keep those knees up hovering above the ground on your lower abs, your lower core here. So nice and still. And then our last one is a clamshell plank, okay? So we'll be here, we're gonna open. It's kind of like a side hip thrust. So open and push, come back down, okay? 30 seconds, hopefully no little hitch drive by while I'm doing that. <laughs> All right, so everything is pretty much on the ground for this last uh, last round. All right, this is it, burnout guys. You'll be done at 6.50, I promise. Are you ready? We got fire hydrants, we're starting. 30 seconds on one side, 30 seconds on the other. Starting in five. Here we go. Four, three, Two. Okay. One. So nice again. flat back. Kick that leg out to the side and back. If you want a band, you can use one. I just find it hinders my mobility so much that I just can't get my leg up high. And this will help with your hip flexor, but you can use a band by all means if you want to. Okay. This still works your glutes. Gives you a little bit more um, mo range of motion than without the band. But either way, you're working hard. Do what you feel is right. We're switching in three. Two, one, switch sides. The last 30 seconds, you should be feeling this on both glutes here as you're working. Woo! You guys, this is killer. It, with the humidity in here, I don't think I've sweat this much in a long time. All right, we're almost there. I don't know if I can do this all the time in this humidity. All right, three, two, one. Next. You guys, we're at bear taps right away. Pick up those those uh, knees off the ground. We're tapping, tapping. Right shoulder, right hand to left shoulder. We're alternating. You're staying nice and still. The whole body is still, except for moving those arms, tapping your shoulders. The more still you try to stay, the more of a workout you're going to get. So keep it nice and still. Listen to some Backstreet Boys with me. me. Enter into Monday morning. Come on, I know you guys love this song. All right, 20 seconds, guys. Then we're doing clamshell plank. Breath. We are almost done. All right, here we go. 10 seconds. Down the line. All right. Three, two, one. Next. All right, you're on your right elbow. You are clamshell plank. So open those knees apart. Push those hips forward, okay? Open and close. Everything's coming up. You don't have to be off that knee. So we're just hip, like a side hip thrust. Push those glutes forward. I saved you guys from doing froggers today or any really, you know, R-rated moves. You're welcome. Switch sides. 30. Let's go. Last 30 seconds. Get as many as possible. Push. Good. Really feel that in those glutes. Big. Push to the top. Push to open. Good, guys. We're almost there. 10 seconds. Woo! Five. Three, two, and time. Good work, guys. Whew. I don't know if that was hard or it's just hot for me. I can't figure this out. It was hard, though. It's hard for me. What did you guys think? Good? Hard enough? Hard enough? Maybe. Good? Good? Yes. Okay. Yeah? Good. yeah? Good. All right, let me take your guys' picture. Take your Did you, picture. Everybody, everybody can hear me and see me well enough. Well enough. Okay, if you okay, have if you any have suggestions for Wednesday morning, Wednesday morning, let me know. And I'm going to try to get the camera up a little higher. Up a little higher. 
Good? Good. Okay. okay. Extra time. Extra time. Let's see. Let's see. If I can get this. One day I'll learn how to do it. All right. All right. Here we go. Are you guys ready? Dave, Suzanne, Amanda, Christopher. All right. Three, two, one. All right. Got it. All right. Got it. Good job, guys. That was really hard. So if you have any comments, text me because I can't hear anything. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. I'll try. Start drinking right now. Bye, guys. Bye. Have fun.